Ciao ragazzi and welcome to a new Laura and Nicholas vlog. <laughs> we made it to Italy. We're actually in the Portofino area. We made it here yesterday, but we're staying for two nights, but we want to take you on a full day, one day in Portofino and just like take you around if you plan on doing a day trip and yeah, just show you around, I guess. But we now made it to Camogli, which is actually right next to Portofino. It's our first time here and apparently it's super beautiful. Well, as you can see behind us, it is. It is. Really Really beautiful. beautiful. So yeah, we're just going to walk around, then we're gonna head to Portofino and just take you guys with us. Let's go. Let's go. So I feel Camogli is actually a little bit bigger than part of Fino. It, it is much bigger. Like if you know, I think about 6,000 people live here in Camogli and only 400 in Portofino. So is that right? Yeah, it's like 15 times bigger. I didn't know. I didn't look that up. I did. <laughs> But um, yeah, there's some beaches here as well. Well, I feel in Portofino you have like these very tiny beaches, but like not really big. If you want bigger beaches, you go to Santa Margarita or you can come here to Camogli. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think we're gonna go and head down to the beach, maybe take a little swim. Nice. Outfit <laughs> on point for the beach. No, no, we, we brought our yeah. swimwear. Laura thinks of everything and she brings my swimwear and everything. Towels, so. yeah, everything. Yeah. She's my like my little PA. Yeah, seriously. Thanks, so babe. True. Nicholas doesn't think of anything. <laughs> okay, let's get some Oh, and beach. I want to have some ice cream. Maybe it's too early for ice cream. It's 11. It is never too early for ice cream in I Italy. Feel, no, if you're in Italy, you can eat ice cream anytime. You it's just take ice cream with fruit flavor and... <laughs> It's like drinking alcohol at the airport. It's never too early. <laughs> Okay, so after spending a little moment by the beach, we now came to a little cafe to grab some coffee. And I must say, it feels good after paying seven euros per coffee in Saint Tropez to have some latte macchiatos for one and a half euro. Right, babe? Yeah. <laughs> and coffee in Italy is really good. Mm. Molto bene. Okay, so that was our time at Camogli and now we're actually driving to Portofino. So that will take about 30 minutes, so it's not that far. And then I like think- Like it's literally less than a kilometer from each other, but you have to drive all the way around, so it takes 30 Yeah, you have to drive like all the way back to, what is it, Rapallo, Rapallo, and then to Santa Margarita, and then you drive to Portofino. So that's what we're if going we to do If we could fly, right we'd be there in 10 seconds. Exactly, we're driving, so we'll see you there. Okay, so we came down to one of our favorite spots here in Portofino which is like right by these beautiful villas it's actually just right before the town of Portofino you can take a little stair down from the main road and then we'll arrive here so we're going to have some lunch here we took some avocado toast a little salad we're just gonna sit here enjoy take a swim Nicholas is already eating um, and yeah we're just going to enjoy and yeah we'll see you later how good is it so good <laughs> so good Okay, so now at the moment you've all been waiting for, we <laughs> finally made it to the city center of Portofino. Yeah, we're gonna show you around and hike up the like hike up to the castle and the church because from there you have a super beautiful view over like the whole port. I don't know. There we go again with the yeah. word port, port. haven, <laughs> marina. <laughs> I'm not sure. I'm not sure which vlog it was that we had like the whole discussion on what to call it. I think that was like two years ago. Yeah, that was literally two years ago, and I still don't know. But um, first, we're gonna go and get changed because we're like all, yeah, obviously in like swimsuits and everything. See you in a minute, and then we'll show you around. Let's go. Okay, so we got changed, and we're back in the town of Portofino, and we're gonna walk all the way up to Castello Brown. That's 
what they call it. So yeah, it's a lot of stairs up, but the view from there is just incredible, you'll see. And then we still need to show you like the center of Portofino because we haven't shown you actually. I wanted to show it to you guys now, but unfortunately this huge ass boat is blocking the whole view, so I can't show you much. So we'll show you from above I'll show first. You later, yeah. Okay, so first stop on our way to Castello Brown is this little church right here. It probably took like 150 steps and then you get this. And you it's also nice. have already a pretty nice view of Portofino yeah. town, mm -hmm. but it's definitely not the best view yet. We're we'll have to there. hike a little bit up to see that, yeah. But I mean, look how beautiful this is. <laughs> Looks like an ideal wedding church. Mm, is that a hint? Uh, maybe. <laughs> Someday. Someday, guys. Someday, guys. Someday. <laughs> Keep subscribing and liking our videos and it will happen sooner than later. <laughs> Okay, so we made it all the way up to Castello Brown and the entrance fee is five euros per person so yeah we really don't know what to expect because we actually have never been here although we've been three times already in Portofino but it's the first time we actually forever. make it up <laughs> no 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 we've been up but we just didn't enter I don't know I think it was close or something yeah we're gonna see and have a look at the view and I don't know which way it is actually I think that way okay let's go I think I know where the way is. Lauren orientation. No, she's actually really good at it. I'm the actually worst. Actually the one who's good at orientation. I'm the worst. Yeah. All right, let's see what this Castello Brown is all about. Yes, guys, we found the best view the in best Portofino. The best view. Look yeah. at this. You can see literally anything from here. So the light is pretty bad, so I'm not sure if it shows really well, but this place is insane. This is not good for me who's afraid of heights. It's like... To give you guys an idea, this is a church where we were half an hour ago. Where you got a pretty nice view but then this this is on a whole nother level laura can't stop taking photos and videos for the gram if you guys don't follow us on instagram yet right here. now is the time So that was Castello Brown and to be honest you have to visit it when it's, you're in it's Portofino. It's 100% worth it. By far the best view on Portofino. Yeah. So now we're finally gonna show you what the city center looks like. <laughs> yeah we're gonna walk Rio. down and yeah and just like a little stroll down and then we're just gonna have a drink and just show you. Okay, so that right there, the castle, that's where we just came from. We walked all the way down and now we're in the center. Let's show you. It, actually, it's super, super small. So it's just full of little bars and restaurants and some shops. You can just like literally walk around in five minutes. So the whole place, as you can see, is a restaurant and in between some luxury shops and another restaurant. And that's how actually the whole place is like. So there's not really too much to show you, no, except like yeah. all the major luxury brands are here. And yeah, then and lots of restaurants. A lot of bars bad and restaurants as well. Yeah, lots of tourist trap restaurants, 100%. Prices also sky high. Definitely. And then on top of that, in most not, places, you have to pay like 10 euros cover, cover charge, charge per and person. And also, it's not always really good. Like yesterday, I had a Negroni, which was the worst Negroni I've ever had in my but life. you still pay 20 euros for yeah, it. Yeah, and it's like not, it's not a difficult drink to make. But so still, we're going to try it again tonight in a different place. In another place, let's hope, fingers crossed. And yeah, this is the main square. You have a little church and then you obviously just have like tons of little boats everywhere it's always like a nice view though if you're sitting in a restaurant or having a drink you always have a super nice view it's also a great place for people watching 100 <laughs> percent, we love that in a nutshell There's this is do. portofino there's not much to do just drink and eat and enjoy and spend a lot of money they so just came back from the hotel put another outfit on laura is putting some last little makeup touches Touch to up. her face and we actually found a spot where we can charge the car because tomorrow we are leaving for the french riviera there is a beautiful new hotel opening that we will do a hotel tour for so if you want to see that make sure to subscribe 
It looks incredible. Now I think we're just gonna grab some drinks. Sun is slowly going down. So yeah, we might have a nice little sunset, do some people watching and have a couple Negronis. That's the plan. Okay guys, so we made it to a little bar. We're just having a few Negronis. And just people watching. It's the best here. Watching people pass by, see what they're wearing, how they are taking photos, asking people to take photos. It's just it's it's the best. It's incredible, yeah. I and love then, it. And then you see people who come from like these big boats. They have staff carrying their Louis Vuitton shopping bags and everything. It's pretty... It's, it's just the scene. It's very interesting. It's just fun to sit here, sit here for like two hours or something and just people watch. And I feel like we have the best seats in the house because we basically see the whole square. Nicholas and I, what we usually do, we just literally watch people and then we make up stories about them. And we just tell each other, I think they're doing this or that, or I think they're on honeymoon. I think he's gonna propose to her, like, you know, like all that stuff. We just make up their stories and that's like how we spend our evening. We just love that. But yeah, was this the vlog already? I think that was the vlog. I think it yeah, was. It was like a very, very short one. After this, we're just gonna grab a bite to eat and then it will get dark and then quality yeah. will be bad. So. so, and then tomorrow we're going to the Mayborn Riviera, which is actually right next to Monaco. So it's in the south of France, French Riviera. It's iconic, it's new, but we will film a tour for you like we already said. So make sure to subscribe so you don't miss that. And thank you guys for watching. Thank you if for you watching. If you made it to the end of this video, I know it was a short one, but Very thank you. Very short. So we're happy that we vlogged again because it took us a little while. Yeah, we've been doing a little too much hotel tours and not enough of real vlogging. Yeah, sorry for that. But we're but back. But we're back and we have so much stuff that's coming up this summer. We're gonna vlog a lot, so. And now you can stop rambling. And I'm gonna stop rambling. Thank you for watching. This is Laura. And Nicholas. See you next week.